What's up guys, today I'm taking you through a complete leg routine. Now you need no equipment, just some space, maybe a wall, but that's about it. And this is for any complete beginner who wants to start getting into calisthenics for 2023. And I really wanna you know, give you guys a sort of guide that can help you level yourself up and I can be a positive influence in this journey. So let's get right to it. All right guys, so first we're gonna do 12 deep squats. Make sure that you're going pretty deep, warming up those hips, getting your legs ready for the movements and control the movement. You know, a lot of people wanna go through the squats fast, but make sure you're controlling the movement while you're going through it. So let's, let's get it. Now you guys can go a little slower or a little faster depending on your level, but I say make sure to take your time with it, go deep and warm up those hips. All right guys, so next we can go through lunges. So basically we're gonna do eight on each leg. So just control the lunge, make sure you're going down just like that. And we're doing eight each leg. All right, guys, so now we take our rest. So rest 30 seconds and make sure, you know, stay hydrated when you're doing this. Make sure you're getting at least a gallon of water in a day if you're really training hard. All right, guys, so next we're gonna do lateral squats. So a lateral squat is basically, you're gonna start off like this, put the leg out, and then you're gonna squat down like that, okay? And we're gonna do 10 for each leg. And you know, this is great for really building up that one leg strength and getting closer to doing pistol squats which is a more advanced movement, where basically you just go down like this. And you know, you just work your way up from there, but these lateral squats are very pivotal and every beginner should really do it. Then we're gonna do Hindu squats, we're gonna do eight Hindu squats. So a Hindu squat, you're gonna start off like this, heels in the air, here heels up, like that. These are great for your tendons and I recommend anyone do this. Uh, you know, if your knees are healthy, if you're okay to do it, I recommend anyone try to do this and strengthen the tendons and joints. So without further ado, let's get to the lateral squats. All right, now to the Hindu squats. Knees over toes on these, knees over toes on these guys. All right guys, now you're gonna rest and we're almost to the end. This is a little bit tougher. Basically, you're gonna do an assisted pistol squat. So you're gonna have to grab onto something, a wall, or anything that's sturdy, and grab onto it as hard as you can. If you're still struggling, that's okay. But you're gonna grab onto it, stick one leg out, and squat down like that. Now, you might cramp doing this, so be careful, because a lot of people aren't used to stretching their leg out just like that. But you know, grab on anything as hard as you can. Maybe you have to grab on two things, but get those pistol squats in. We're gonna do four for each leg. If you're more advanced, then you can do a regular pistol squat. Or if you're even more advanced, then you can do an explosive pistol squat. So basically, you just jump up at the end of it. So we're gonna do four for each leg. Okay, up the leg. All 
All right, guys, now we're going to jumping squats. So basically, eight jumping squats, jump as high as you can. A regular squat, you're just gonna explode up. So let's get it. <laughs> All right, guys, so now you can rest if you need to. And next we're gonna do wall sits. So this is our last exercise. You're gonna go to at least 30 seconds, try to push yourself and go to failure if you're up for the challenge. And you know, this is it. So for beginner, you can try this once. If this was too easy, try it again, but do less rest time and do slightly more reps. All right, so let's get to it. All right, guys, in the, the video, I hope you enjoyed it. Leave a like if you did, and comment down below what you want to see next. I really want to help put beginners on and show you guys how you guys can start. Because me personally, when I first started, you know, I looked up to other people, and I want to be one of them, those people that can really influence you to change your life in a more positive way, whether it's getting in shape, getting stronger, or just being a better athlete. So that's the end of the video, guys. I hope you enjoyed it, and I'll see you next time.